Fox News is going to be in court. They've started the jury selection in the Dominion Fox News case. Dominion is suing Fox News for $1.6 billion. And while that gets a lot of attention, right, in media circles, leftist extremists that uh, happens to the media these days, they're really into this. And they kind of like enjoy it, which is a little weird to me because it may, if they have to pay the fine, set a challenging precedent because it means you got to be really, really now. We always want to be really careful with our facts, right? You don't go and report something unless you really, really know it. But as a journalist, part of reporting something means asking questions and pushing to get the truth. And so when kind of important people make really big allegations, you feel a need to follow up and say, okay, well, is there any there there? And in that process of finding out whether there's any there there, well, it could be damaging as it was or as Dominion claims, it was to them. So that's an issue, not for Fox News. And I'll tell you, because Fox can handle it. Like, they get a ton of money. I mean, they're making, what, more than $2 billion, I think, last check. They're going to be fine. The question is, what does it mean for every other channel out there, for every other independent creator out there? Yes, we all need to be responsible. I'm not going to say that we shouldn't. And if they can somehow prove that, Fox News very deliberately put forward a tale that they knew was not true, all in an effort to keep viewers, well, then they may in fact be guilty. But that is going to be sort of the burden of proof, if you would, because the First Amendment is very powerful. And you know, I always stand for it and I believe in it. And I really do feel that the bad speech or the untrue speech can be cured by more speech, right? That's what we need more of. We don't want to suppress it in any way.